Let's try to solve this problem. For number 1, we have 3 times 4 plus 64 divided by 4 minus 3. So to solve this problem, we need to apply PEMDAS. So what is PEMDAS? So PEMDAS is an acronym which is the rule that we need to follow when we need to perform a series of operations. So P stands for parentheses which can be different grouping symbols such as parentheses itself, braces, or bracket. E stands for exponents like 2 square, 3 cube, and so on. M stands for multiplication. D stands for division. A stands for addition. And S stands for subtraction. So using PEMDAS, we must perform first the grouping symbol followed by the exponents next are multiplication or division so for multiplication and division we need to perform the operation that comes first from left to right while for addition and subtraction we must operate first the operation that comes from left to right okay so for this problem since we are given multiplication addition division subtraction so from pemdas we must operate first multiplication or division so we must operate first on the multiplication part because multiplication comes first before the division from left to right so multiplying 3 times 4 first that will be 12 then copy the remaining expression plus 64 divided by 4 minus 3 next is the division so we must divide 64 by 4 first, so that's equal to 16. So we have 12 plus 16 minus 3 as the remaining expressions. Next, we have addition and subtraction. So we must perform from left to right addition, which is 12 plus 16. 12 plus 16, that's equal to 28, then minus 3. So lastly, 28 minus 3, that's equal to 25. So the final answer is 25. Next, we have quantity 36 plus 4 divided by 5 minus 2 squared times 2. So again, using PEMDAS. So we must perform first the parenthesis P. So 36 plus 4, we have 40. Then copy the remaining expression. 40 divided by 5 minus 2 squared times 2. Next is the exponent. So we have 2 square. So 2 square means 2 factors of the base 2. 2 times 2, that's 4. So we now have 40 divided by 5 minus 2 times 2. Next is multiplication or division. So this time division comes first from left to right. So we must perform first 40 divided by 5. That's 8. Then we have minus 4 times 2. Then, multiplication, we have 4 times 2, that's 8. So, we have 8 minus 8. Lastly, subtraction, 8 minus 8, that's 0. So, the final answer is 0. Next, we have 27 divided by 3 squared plus quantity 4 minus 2 times 9. Again, using PEMDAS. So, we must perform first the parentheses. So, 4 minus 2, that's 2. Then, copy the remaining expression, 27 divided by 3 squared plus 2 times 9. Next is the exponent, so we have 3 squared. So, 3 squared means 2 factors of 3, so 3 times 3, that's 9. Copy the remaining expression, so we have 27 divided by 9 plus 2 times 9. Next is multiplication or division. So, division comes first. Okay, before the multiplication. So, let's divide first 27 divided by 9. That's 3. Copy the remaining expression plus 2 times 9. Next is multiply 2 times 9. So, that's 18. Then, we have 3 plus 18. Finally, we need to add 3 plus 18. That's 21. So, the final answer is 21. Okay, now it's your turn to try to solve this problem and just comment your answer.